What's up, movie crew? Welcome to night 15 of 31 Nights of Horror. Today is Friday. That means it's Family Friendly Friday. Which leads us to a special episode of Let's Watch, where I am two weeks late on Adam's Family 2. All right, so... I love the Adams Family as a franchise. I own the original series on DVD. I own the movies from the 90s. I own the animated movie from a few years back. I remember watching, there was another live action show on in the 90s that I remember enjoying. I'm a fan of this franchise, all right? I will say the most recent animated movie, I liked it, but it could have been better. But I do want to go and see the new one. I'm going to be buying it once the physical media releases out. So I'm just going to leave it at that. I'm going to go in here. I'm going to watch Adam's Family 2. And then I'm going to come back and give everyone my thoughts. Alright, so I just got out of seeing Adam's Family 2. And my overall thoughts are this movie's pretty much the same as the first. You like the first one, you're gonna like the second one. You didn't like the first one, I would not recommend seeing the second one. There were a couple of things in this movie that did get me. So there is a scene where Wednesday and Lurch have separated from the rest of the group. And Wednesday tells Lurch, we are going to travel like the Donner Party. Do what we must and eat what we have to along the way. They managed to put that in a PG movie. Kudos to the people that made The Addams Family 2 and being able to do that. And one of the other ones that I thought was amusing. One of the side plots is the grandmas having a party while they're out on a trip. And you see these two influencers walk into the house. And you hear, OMG, this place is such a mood. This flower slaps. And just that whole dynamic, it reminds me about some of the characters that the Adams Family would meet on the stuff that I remember watching in the 90s. Because I think on the 90s TV show, there was someone that went up to Gomez and was like, Yo, what's up? And just that dynamic always gets me. I'm going to be honest. That, that little bit always gets me on that stuff. Um, my overall things I liked about the movie were solid plot, very good movie from beginning to end. It didn't overstay its welcome because... As I've mentioned before, I've had an issue recently with some movies being a little too long. My biggest issue with this movie is the A plot is very predictable. And all the other side plots within the movie, I found more entertaining than the main story. And I felt like I should not be saying that about this particular movie. I feel like I should enjoy the main plot more than everything else. But the main plot was predictable. They threw a couple of twists and turns along the way, but even then, it was like, I know how this is going to end. And I was right. That bothered me a little bit. The side plots, like the grandma having the party while the rest of the family's on a road trip. That was great. Wednesday trying to instigate Lurch into a fight was amazing. And, but again, overall, like I said, I did like the movie. I enjoyed it. But it was definitely more of the same. So if you weren't a fan of the first one... I'm not going to recommend this one. If you're like me and you like The Addams Family, you like the first movie, check this one out. But that's going to do it for this one. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. You like what you see? 
leave a thumbs up. Comment down below if you have seen The Addams Family too. What are your thoughts? But that's going to do it for this one. So thank you all for watching and tune in next time.